Hi guys! Today's video tutorial is how to draw afro hairstyles. The pokerate brushes that I'm going to be using are from the afro and curly hair brushes. Today, I'll be showing you how to create these two looks. Let's get ready before we start. You can pick the hair color palette from the photo or from the hair color palettes that come with the brushes. For the first hairstyle, the colors that I use are different shades of gray and black. Now you can import the model into the canvas and we're ready to go. We start by sketching a draft of the hairstyle Create a shape and some rough hair direction. Next, create two layers for the hair base, one for the top and one for the bottom. I'm using the deepest gray color from the palette with the hair texture fill brush to create the overall hair base. And then I use black color to make a deeper shade of color around her neck. And then I'm going to use the deepest shade of gray and repeat the same step for the top base layer. Next, I'm creating a new layer for the detail base and I'm using black color with the curl number 6 brush to create the hair texture. And I'm creating a new layer on top of her body because I need to add the texture around the neck area. Next, for the new layer, I'm going to start to add more highlight to her hair, starting with the dark medium gray, and I'm using the brush Curves 3. You should follow the direction on the draft so you can keep the hair direction in place. And I'm going to use a lighter shade of medium gray to add more highlight to the same layer. Next, on the new layer, I'm using Brush Curls 9 with light gray color to create a new texture for her highlight. In the next process, I'll be switching back and forth between layers to add the hair locks with black and light gray colors.
And next, we are going to do some final touch up. I need to clean up the white line around her face, so I created a new layer just above her face and then used in black the hair texture fill brush to fill in the area. And then I'm going to use the eraser tool with the soft airbrush to clean up some excess color. The next look is inspired by my favorite person, Mama Ru from RuPaul Drag Race. Start with the preparation. All the beautiful colors are in the first row of the hair color palettes. And I've already sketched out the hairstyle from the reference photo. And then create layers for the hair base. The first brush that I'm going to be using is the Afro Hair Texture 5 with the reddish brown color. I use this brush to create the all over hair base. And then I'm creating these two layers to fill in another color for the hair complexion with the brush Curls 10. Next, create another layer for the highlight and I'm using the creamy color with the Curls 9 brush.
Then I create a new layer for the final highlight. The first brush that I would like to try is the Curl Hair One Fluffy. I think I would like to try another one. Let's try Curl Hair Six. I think this one works quite well, so I'm gonna use it. And now I'm cleaning up the excess colors with the eraser tool and soft brush. Next, I'm creating a new hairline around her forehead because the reference photo, Mama Ru, is wearing a wig. So she doesn't have the hairline. We are filling in the natural hairline with the hair strand brush. And for the final step, I'm going to go back to the base layer at the bottom and use the hair base fill brush to create more dimension to the entire artwork as well as cleaning up the white line around her face and neck. And we finish. 